Well, teaching kids that it is better to give than to receive is a valuable lesson. Our Josh Peterson shows us how area churches are instilling in kids the true meaning of Christmas through one special program. The hallways of Bemidji's Evangelical Free Church was dressed for the holidays and filled with Santa's helpers as they prepared boxes of toys to be shipped all around the world as part of Operation Christmas Child. The whole, every single one of the boxes is going to um, have some sort of Bible gospel tract in it. And so it's going to be telling the message of Jesus all over the world. Each age group had a bundle of toys ready to be sorted, picked, and placed into decorative shoe boxes, all in an effort to spread Christmas joy while educating kids at the same time. The kingdom of God is going forward, not just here. And I think a lot of times we have an idea that things are just happening at our little church or our, in our town, but they don't understand the magnitude of what God is doing all over the world. For the kids, when they went shopping, it was all about relating to a child that they don't even know and making sure they experience the best Christmas ever. I want him to feel happy and excited because he got a Christmas present. While the kids get into the spirit of giving, there's also a special message that leaves an impact on more than just the child. If we start them young and we start this process, people are going to be, um, you know, able and understand the process more as they get older. Each box contains more than just toys and treats. It also contains a message of hope and love. Um, I want them to feel happy and that they know that Jesus loves them. With only a few days remaining before all the boxes are shipped and delivered all over the world, kids and adults alike will be busy playing the role of Santa's helpers. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. The official Operation Christmas Child Shoe Box drop-off site is the Evangelical Free Church in Bemidji. Boxes will be packed and loaded on a semi next Monday. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.